Hey, I'm your host, Burton, coming to you live from my basement. Let's summon an amazing Let's Play series. We managed to make it through the sacred ground so that we can find the Master Sword, the bane of evil's existence, so that we might be able to get out of this wolf form, go back into human form, and save the world from the Zant, the evil minion weird guy. So, um, in this episode, we are going to be finding the Master Sword, and we have to get these guys to let us through. In order to, to awaken these guys, we're going to have to howl. This is going to be a shorter episode today, so bear with me there. <laughs> Most shaky Zelda's lullaby ever. Um, so, just keep whistling. Or howling. So, now that that's done, Triforce pops up, boom! Welcome to the weakest, the weakest link. So, this is the hardest puzzle in Zelda history. We are guardians of this land. Guide us to where we once stood. Only then can you enter the true sacred grove. So, what we have to do is we have to get these guys to go back to their original spots. I am a cheater, so I actually have it pulled up on my computer right now. Where does it say I need to go? Okay, so, we need to start by going this direction. What happens is I move, as I move, they respond to my movement, so... Uh, I gotta do this. And there are several different ways you can solve this puzzle. There's not just one way. So, if you find a different way to do this, then that's fine. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. So then I move this way. I'm a cheater. I don't. I don't know. I'm fine with that. Oh dang it! I did something wrong. Oh no! I did something wrong. Okay. Gotta see if this restarts it. Ah! Uh, I see what this is going on here. Okay. So one more movement, and we're gonna be done. You move up, and ta-da, ta-ta-ta-ta-ta, that's it, but um, that's got like so many different combinations to it, if you weren't doing a, using a guide like I was, you probably wouldn't have been able to do it, you pro yeah, it's just, I mean, you might have, but it's just insane, go now to the sacred place, beast, we yield passage to the sacred grove, so that's about it. These guys are dead now. We'll never have to worry about that puzzle ever again. Unless you really love doing that puzzle and you wanted to do it again. But we really do not need to be doing that. Uh, exit out. Thank you. So, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be entering this place and go to the Sacred Grove to get out of this beast's form. Get in. 
secret. This aim to try to them. Get your door, man. Break my one as can't feel me. Be good to get what you need me. Get root city jits to reply aim to swift. This way, what word you could do it and with? So this is probably the most game-changing moment in the game. Like, most awesome moment in the game. I think that's the most awesome moment in the game. Not only do we get to turn into a wolf whenever we want now, though, we also are able to warp wherever we want, um, as long as we've been there, considering we've been there, because we can turn into a war wolf whenever we want to. So, we have the Master Sword now. Woo! So let's say you really wanted to... Um, really don't like the Master Sword and for some reason you don't want to use it or you want to challenge yourself, you always have the ability to go back to the Ordon Sword if you really wanted to. You probably don't want to do that though because the Master Sword is cooler and it also um, does more damage. So we have the Master Sword, that's about it. We are done here. We have reached the halfway point in this game. We have the Master Sword and now we have the ability to take down Xant. And that's it for this episode. So, until next time, I am your host, coming to you live from my basement. See ya.